In a vacant field near Cal Expo, red-shirted SMUD employees and blue-shirted PG&E employees were flinging dirt. No, not at each other. Instead, volunteers from both utilities joined forces for a good cause, planting plants that will attract bees and other pollinators, many of which are losing their habitats or dying at an alarming rate from pesticide misuse and diseases. This community project is located next to the American River Bike Trail near the Cal Expo Horse Stables. The plants were placed underneath the rows of gigantic transmission towers that deliver electricity to customers of both utilities and others in the West. We have a, a mandate to keep these lines reliable, clear of vegetation. If SMUD didn't take on these types of activities, ultimately vegetation could reach up and in contact and cause outages on these rights of ways. The two utilities worked with the County of Sacramento, which manages the land as part of the American River Parkway, to find plants for this project. The county grew the plants in a nursery and brought them to the site. The plants that we're planting today are low growing, they are easy to maintain, they don't require us to come back in here and do a lot of mowing and disturbing of the site afterwards. The county collected the seeds of local plants that would also attract bees and other pollinators. This got the San Francisco based Pollinator Partnership involved. The international nonprofit organization is the largest in the world dedicated to the protection and promotion of pollinators and their ecosystems. Among the pollinators facing problems are bees. There's a lot of problems facing bees. We hear about pesticide misuse, we hear about um, diseases like colony collapse disorder impacting honeybees, but really the biggest problem is they can't find a place to live. Habitat is key and we're losing the habitat that's appropriate for bees at a huge level every day. Helping the bees actually means helping protect, create, restore habitat that they can use. They need the right plants for their survival and we humans in turn need the bees and other pollinators for our survival. Bees are really, really important to every part of our daily lives. One third of the food we eat, so one of every three bites, wouldn't be on our plates if bees weren't around to pollinate those crops. You lose bees, you lose at least 30% of your food and 90% of your landscape can deteriorate. They're vital. The plight of the bees helped motivate the volunteers at the recent planting event. When I heard the bees were actually being affected, um, I want to know, I wondered what I could do. So I planted flowers, flowers all around my home. And when I heard about this, I was just very excited to come and get here. The volunteers' efforts don't go unnoticed. I really appreciate the SMUD volunteers that come out because it shows our commitment to the community when we have employees that come out and do that.